And straight now to Oyo State, where the Independent National Electoral Commission has engaged relevant stakeholders in the state on the rationale behind the conversion of the existing voting point into full polling units. Here is more as presented from our studio. The Resident Electoral Commission REC in Oyo State, Mathieu Aboke, while addressing the stakeholders, noted that the Commission has decided to start early engagement on the urgency of voters having access to polling units. Aboke, who disclosed that the state had 1,607 voting points and 4,783 polling units, said with the conversion of the voting points, the state would now have 6,000 319 polling units. The objective of this present exercise are among others to expand voter access to polling units by converting the existing voting points and voting point settlement into full polling units. INEC is not creating additional polling units, but rather INEC is converting existing voting points to polling units. Various stakeholders, however, call for creation of more wards in the state as the present population has outnumbered the current data used by the independent National Electoral Commission. There's a need for additional polling booths, but that cannot be made automatic. So what they have done in the meantime is to turn polling units into polling booths to make um, voting easily accessible to our people. And then with the times of COVID right now, you know, you can't have too many people at the same time. It will make voting less rowdy. It will make it um, smoother. Uh, the, this process you know, was made for 50 million Nigerians, and we know that uh, we are expanding in our numbers. We know that there are areas that are just uh, newly uh, uh, new settlements, and they need to provide for them. And for them to, you know, sit down to be doing that on their side, nobody will believe that we get to a stage that I never will want to uh, upgrade, you know, polling, uh, voting. A year rec boss further explained that the commission will be migrating for direct data capture machine DDCM used during the last election to INEC voter enrollment device IVED based on an Android tablet for effective voting exercise. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.